guys, I hope you enjoyed Alex's video of her going through her closet. Today we are doing my closet, which is much smaller. It should be much easier, hopefully. And you're not emotionally attached to anything. And I'm not emotionally attached to clothes, so. And yes, this is Will's closet in the spare bedroom because um, my madness took over the other one. There's also book bags and communal hats. We'll focus on the clothes. Let's start with the communal stuff. Oh no, we just did me. Let's let's focus on, can, can we just focus on your stuff for like a hot minute? Dress pants I never wear that I don't like. The, wait. No. That's your only suit. No, these are different. No, that goes with your gray suit. You have to keep that. I have my other suit. You have a tan suit from our wedding. Yeah, that's You're... my only suit. That's the only suit I want. You... No, if you have to go to a funeral or something, that's your gray suit. You're keeping that. I'm sorry. See, I, I can't even keep, get rid of my own stuff. That that was the only one I was already expecting to <laughs> mandate that you keep. You're keeping that for death. See what I'm dealing with? Keep your death suit. Belt. I guess I have to keep that, huh? For your death day. Oh, I hate all of these ties. I would rather get a different new tie. Okay. I swear everything will be easier after this. I'm the one who bought all of Will's like nice clothes. Those three ties are lovely. We got those last year. No. I've had this okay, before okay. I met sure. You. But the blue one and the striped one we bought for your gray suit. Keep okay. one. Keep these two. Okay. How about that? Okay, you're not really a bow tie man. All right, those are the only items I'm gonna comment on. I swooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooo
Three or four years? Numero dos. So you're supposed to say thank you. Thank you. What do we think about this shirt? It's not awful, right? No, it's got a bleach stain on the arm, but it's fine. Where? The other arm. It's real small. Where? Oh, oh is it a hole? No, it's just thin. No, it's fine. It's it's like, if it's smaller than a penny, keep. <laughs> Tangent shirt number three. I think I actually want to keep this one because my buddy Mendez did this bleach job on it, and I think it's cool. This is a shirt I received from work that was free because somebody left it there. And it says, holla at your boy, but it's in the LaCroix logo. Should I keep this? I think it's funny. I think it's funny. Too. That, you can wear that joke. Yeah. Jensen Speaker Company t-shirt. This is a pretty cool shirt. Has no stains. No stains. I actually haven't had it very long. It's nice. Okay. Oh gosh, yes. This, this is a t-shirt from my metal hardcore days back in middle and high school and I loved it for a long time and I used to wear a big belt buckle and I would, whenever you lean up against something it eventually causes this hole but I think it's time thank you shirt I don't really care about it but I guess it's a nice shirt this is a t-shirt me and Alex both got that would have a stain on it from hog wild which was an event we did at a farm I have one as well we'll keep it it's a work shirt Will doesn't have too many shirts so low vintage don't you? No, you keep it. You like that shirt. Nothing. Well, you can go back through. Okay, I'm making this worse. This is your dad's shirt. It's off limits. It's also cool. Matthew Logan Vasquez t-shirt. Shout out. Adult Spirit, one of my favorite bands. I should keep this. Mm -hmm. You can get rid of the low vintage if you want. I mean, it's black graphic tee. All right, going back. But hold on. Sorry. Would you wear the low vintage more than the stained hog wild shirt? I mean, that's a good work shirt. Okay. I like that shirt. It, it means more to me than that. Shout out Will Lowe, though. Just because you worked on the farm. It was hard work. Yeah. You didn't have to do anything. Like to... people. You like Will. Yeah, no, I said shout out Will Lowe. <laughs> this is a cool shirt, but I have a lot of other black t-shirts. Down Hart Jr.'s roller coaster that never, or that doesn't exist anymore, the Intimidator, R.I.P. Dale. But I think I'm going to get rid of it. It's a cool shirt. Somebody else needs it. I like that one. Oh my gosh, Alex. Okay, okay, okay. No, but we're about to- you do this? No, no, <laughs> sorry. I like that shirt. It's a nice graphic t-shirt. I like it more than the LaCroix one. you get one. this for me? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Am I keeping this? Yes, Alex? for now. We can go back. I'm sorry. I, I knew- I'm the worst. Change the shirt number four. You may get rid of that. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Tangent slash the root shirt number five. That one does have a hole in it. This one has a hole in it. Now this- Looking back at it is crazy. <laughs> but our buddy Mendez made this for us for a pop-up we did. And it is cool, but I feel like I'm not ever going to wear it. I Let me feel like we should sell it. Maybe we can auction I'm it. I'm not going to wear this. Okay. It's cool. I like the story. I like that Mendez made it, but I'm not going to wear it. Other than the one time we did this. I kept mine. Yeah. You were wearing it earlier today. I was. Yesterday. Yesterday. So if you want some limited edition Moontide shit, Disco bow happened once, but there's t-shirts to show that it happened. Another, I guess I do have some sentimental value behind the clothes. Oh. This is my old band, Job of the Mary, with ground for tea, three quarters length baseball tee from our European tour. I don't even really want to keep this shirt to wear it because I went all these places in Europe and played music and it was fun. It's a lot of good memories. New fleece long sleeve that I like, definitely my vibe. Another Disco Bow Limited. That one's cool. This one's cool. I think this is Shay's. No, this one was mine and the other one was Shay's. You don't think you'll wear that one? That one's cool. Okay, I'll wear this one. Okay. Because it's like less. Shout out Memphis. All right, this is a cool shirt, but I've had it for a while. It's got a stain. It's from Zion National Park, which it would be cooler if I actually went there, but this was a gift from your parents. Great shirt. Great shirt. But I'll go there and get a shirt one day. Come on. This is a vintage shirt that I got a few months ago. I think it's cool. I think I should keep it. Where'd you get it? Revision. This is a no questions asked, gotta keep. Levi's black denim. Another great shirt that I wish I had been to the place that it was. Alaska. Super cool shirt. I don't even care if I haven't been there. I gotta keep this shirt. It's got sparkle silver. Like, come on. This was my favorite shirt for a long time. Um, what happened to it? We, I lost it. I left it at my parents' beach house. I thought that this shirt was like a little bit sexist because on the back it's like this is the best, best tail, tail in, in town. town, and it's like okay, it's not it's not terrible, but it it just isn't like Will. Will's like the super kind like 
guy, I don't know. So I didn't feel like it was him. He swore I donated it because I donate a lot of clothes every once in a while. He's like, you donated it, you donated it. I was like, no, I didn't. I would never go into your closet and take something of yours. Except to wear. Except to wear. And so we're at the beach, his parents' beach house. And I'm like, I always check under the beds when I leave places because things get shoved under there. Will has this habit, especially with his socks. He takes his socks off before he gets in bed. And then he just kind of like kicks them under the bed. I don't know, for like safety. And so I was checking under the bed of the beach house and in the middle of the bed, all rolled up, lo and behold, this shirt that I donated. It's got some holes. Tiny. What do you think? I like it. All right, keep it. It says member of the tub club. Maybe the t-shirts from places I haven't been is my thing, because I have a lot of them. Poser. I mean. Yeah, the coolest poser. Aspirational. The best tail in town. Referring to shrimp, obviously not women. Off-white, Eddie Bauer fleece, long sleeve, tight. Brand new, Target, black fleece, tight. All right, okay. Oh no. <laughs> this shirt does, I guess, have some sentimental value. I traded this shirt to Schultz, who was in the band Job of the Mary that I was in, for a misprint lot further shirt, which is a Grateful Dead affiliated band. And so it has good memories and I think it's cool. It's really comfy. I wear it basically every time I get tattooed on my chest or torso region. Now this shirt, the shirt was a gift <laughs> from my aunt. It says Chef Sanders. It's funny, but I think it's time that it sails on to its final home. No, I love that shirt. I think it's so funny. But I think it would be funnier now that someone else is gonna wear it. I say you hold on to it just for the first time we open a food truck. I, I just think it's so funny. This shirt. Dope. Dope, got it for free, but it's a little short. Mm. It, my belly shows it from reaching up. So I think I should sell it. Okay, it is cool. It's a cool shirt. Okay, now this, I normally love a fleece, and I like that it's polo, but it's tight. And it's stripes. And it's stripes, yeah, okay. I'm sorry for making the process slower. <laughs> we can go back and get rid of more t-shirts. No, I'm serious, I'm sorry. Super Ooh, red, half keep. Cheap, half vintage, paid for it, not free. And the logo is just slightly off center. I love that. This shirt is a gift from my wifey dearest, fermentation station of Bon Appetit. Shout out Brad Bailey. Okay, now we're to the collared shirts. This one, super cool. The, what do you call these? Snap. Snap, snap buttons. I love it. the pattern, it's this way, and then the top part goes the other way. Love it, will not get rid of. This is the shirt that I tried to wear last night with the Fargo camo pants that Alex said it looked like I was going hunting. I gotta keep. This is brand new fleece. Haven't even worn it yet. Vintage Wrangler, dope ass dress shirt, I guess. But I wear it as like an overshirt. Too cool to get rid of, love it. Alex got this for me. Vintage Wrangler snap button. Does have a hole, but I think it's cool. Fits me well, it's like off color. I think it's great. Gotta keep sweatshirt, Target. Alex just got this for me for Christmas. You gotta keep this shirt. I don't know, let's try it on. It's pretty cool, fits me. What do you think? You can see through the back, which I think is cool. I think it's good. I think it's good too. Now this shirt, I love a good denim shirt, but I don't love this denim shirt. It's Target. I feel like Target stuff after like six months, it's like, all right, you got out of it, what you're gonna get out of it. Plus it's like made to look old. Yeah, that's not cool. Vintage Wrangler, cool as hell. Never gonna get rid of this until it rips apart. This is a cool shirt. Jeez, I still have so much stuff. I have to get rid of stuff. <laughs> what do you think? I think get rid of it. It's a little softer than all your other looks. Okay. And I'm kind of thinking maybe this white shirt too. Really? Just kind of see through. I don't like that. We'll try that one on if you want it again. Try it on? Sure. I think it's cool. It's super soft. It's very comfy. I like this one more than the white one. I agree. Get rid of this guy. Cool shirt, just not for me. And plus, like, your closet is still so full. I'm one to talk, I know. I fucking hate this shirt. Don't want it. Alex probably makes me keep it. And that Bella Marie shirt from Kenya. I hate it. I don't want it. Don't think I can argue that one. Stupid. Love this shirt when I got it, but I've worn it enough. Alex hates it. It's fine. Oh, I'm like, I'm like grinning. <laughs> She's gleaming behind the camera. Because my problem with this shirt is I would be fine with it if you wore it in the summer 
or if you wore it to like a pool party or the beach, like that's all appropriate. Like I'm not gonna wear my jumpsuit that you saw earlier that's beach themed out to a nice restaurant. Will will wear this in October to a nice restaurant and then come and be like, what? <laughs> why are you mad? I'm like, I'm not mad. I just don't understand why the fuck you're wearing that shirt, man. Never had too many flannel, so I don't have many. Okay, this shirt. Gotta go. Another Target shirt. I don't like it anymore. Same deal. That last shirt. Oh, this is J. Crew. This is a nice shirt. I'll sell this one. And that one's a little short on you. Vintage Wrangler. Wore this in Europe. Can't get rid of it. It is a little small on you. No, it's not. It's not. You wanna see? Super cool. Not gonna get rid of it. Okay, this shirt needs a button. Gonna sell. Another vintage Wrangler, cool little bowler shirt. I want to keep it. You don't like it, do you? No, it's not that I don't like it. I just, you have a lot of vintage Wranglers. That's my thing. Okay, well, we'll have to do another sweep where you make decisions. This one, I can get rid of because it's like the same thing as this one. This one has the, like, little metal strips in the collar. Levi's, warm jacket. Gotta keep this. Eddie Bauer, what do you call it? Poofy jacket? I call them puffers. Puffers. Her whole family has one. I felt included whenever they gave me one. Part of the cult. Rain jacket with a big hole in it. Not even gonna. Lame ass dress shirt that I hate. I don't want. Part of that gray suit. <coughs> <laughs> <coughs> I'm literally allergic to it, Alex. Men's warehouse. It's so ugly. I hate it. But you're gonna make me keep it. You can keep it at your mother's for emergencies. I hate it. What do you think about this? I mean, it's nice. You can wear it under your puffer jacket. It's a good layering, warm. It's a good. I don't like it. But you don't have anything else to layer. I guess I do. You're a t shirt with a fleece and then a jacket. Okay, if you don't like it, get rid of it. But I think it's good. I think it's a nice. This is my closet, my stuff. You're right. Got this at Goodwill. I don't need it. But it fits nice either way. Oh my god. What if I let you throw away that gray suit? Or don't. <laughs> One of the coolest shirts ever to exist. Bought it in New Mexico, wore it for engagement photos. Gotta keep, this is a nice shirt, authentic Western. Are you gonna wear it? I like to wear it, yeah. You can wear it to that funeral. We hope nobody dies. But if they do, we will come clothed. Super cool, vintage Western, long tail, California, like nice ass shirt. Got married in it, gotta keep it. Suit that I got married in, super red, gotta keep it. Some weird ass fleece Doctor Strange shit that I don't wear. Probably the last time I wore it was in high school. No, you were. You were, and it snowed our first snow together. Mm. Oh, Trash for me to find in the laundry, <laughs> and you know it. Warm snowboarding jacket. It's pretty cool. I should keep. Yeah, we got it on sale. It's nice. Oh, yeah. those are our snow pants. These don't fit me. Those ones? Yeah. Do they fit me? No. They're too small. I think I... You bought these. Those are mine. Yeah. I about ripped the... What do you call this area? The crotch. I about ripped it last time. Why? Because you're so packed? I think because I've grown taller. You're supposed to say yeah. Okay. Shoes? Ah. Uh, we'll do shoes and then we'll go back through because that's still... We can go back through. What about your pants? We went through. Oh, you feel calm. We did it first. Yeah. We're gonna go back over my stuff because we feel like I still have a lot and I shouldn't have that many clothes. I don't want this. You want me to have this. I'm getting rid of it. I have another suit. I can wear that suit to a funeral. Yes, yes. It will just stay at your mother's. Let's not readdress this. Go okay, put it I'm back. Gonna put it on the... No, it's it's right there. You need a hanger. I'm gonna find Will outside with a bonfire with this. Like I need to get it tailored. I'd rather really just wear my other nice suit. Keep. Mm -hmm. Keep. I think I can retire this shirt. I agree. Congratulations, you're on retirement. I think I should retire this shirt. I should probably throw it away. I can't actually do anything in it. You don't sleep in shirts? No. This is such a plain Jane shirt. I can get rid of it. What's wrong with Jane? I don't know. Her name is plain. Yeah, nothing like Will or Alex. I want to keep this one. Okay. I can get rid of this one. Yep, let someone else enjoy the joke. Keep. Keep. What do you think? It has a stain. You can wear mine. I really don't think it's that shrunk. Keep. Fine. Keep, 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 keep. Get rid of. Bye, Molly. Bye, Molly. Bye, Molly. I really liked you. Keep, keep, keep. You can get rid of this one. It's your only flannel. 
Go ahead, Just keep it. Get rid of one of the collared. No, I think you're pretty good. It's not that much hanging stuff. Nine, All right, one, so let's two, see three, what you've two, done. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten collared shirts. 16 key and fleece shirts. You can go two weeks without wearing the same t-shirt. That's plenty. Shoesies. These are all my clothes. I wish you hadn't done this with the hangers. You could have just... Fine. Just leave them there for now. Okay, we'll start up here. One of my only nice pairs of shoes. Leather sole. I like them. They're good dress shoes. Yeah, just keep them. We'll keep them wherever we hide that we'll suit. Them nice. Look at our dog. Stop it. Cowboy boots that I wore for our wedding. Super cool, gotta keep. Work boots, another big and clunky, but I wanna keep these because they'll last forever. Cheap dress shoes that I don't like, get rid of. These are nice dress shoes that I just got. I feel like I have too many dress shoes though. I wanna keep these. Tennis shoes, probably the only shoes like this that I have. I'll keep them until I get a new pair. Crocs, put them in the dryer and shrunk them. Too small, can't fit. Bands that are old as hell and dirty, don't need anymore. Bands that I've had for a long time, love them, but I got a new pair of shoes coming in the mail. Don't need these anymore. Vans that are starting to tear apart, but they're still cool. I don't need them anymore. Clarks, had them for a long time, could keep these. I mean, you, those brown boots in there will do the same job. You think? You're right. Are you sure you don't want to keep these brown vans or one of these vans to skate in? I'll you do, don't have a I'll nice tennis shoe. Right and these shoes that I'm wearing, another pair of Clarks that are really comfy. Work boots, nice boots for sentimental value. Dress shoes, Nike sneakers, vans to shit kick. Okay, is that all of my clothes? Oh, Alex's Zion National Park hat. Salem, corduroy. Love a good corduroy hat. Gotta keep. Belt, everyday belt. Beer Co. hat. I'm gonna get rid of this one. This is your grandfather's Lockheed corduroy hat. Love it. Used to wear it all the time. The leather is ripping in the back. So I wanna keep this, but if somebody knows how to fix leather like this, hit us up. Bluebird. This hat was given to me by Wade of Local Apparel. Super nice guy, like the hat, but I have a lot of hats. I don't need it. Or what do you think? Just cool keep thing. it. It's corduroy, it's stitched. Yeah, you're right. You only have three hats. This is a Norfolk Southern Railroad hat. It's a little small, it's cool. I'm gonna get rid of it though. That's Alex, my second hat. Alex's second hat, you want this? Yeah, I don't think anyone wants it. It's like my dirty hiking hat. Alex's college, she was in a sorority, shocker. I think it's pretty cool. I like the pocket. And it's ironic if I wear it. And it's really small. I should keep it. The barking deck, which I think is close, but I just thought it was such a cool tie-dye hat. Gotta keep. Sweet old belt that's been with me everywhere. Gotta keep. Plus I wear it. Plus you wear it. Mickey tote. They have so many totes. This literally has another tote inside of it. I know. We're gonna get rid of totes. We'll make a tote pile. This bag is literally full of cool ass hats that Sadie, our little munchkin here, chewed up whenever we first got her because I would leave them on the sofa. Like she's trying again. She's going for it. No, Sadie. But yeah, she, she so, would only rip. Only rip like this right here on all of these hats. So I think we're gonna keep these, but fix them and try to sell them. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Really excited to continue this decluttering and cleaning process and get into our trailer. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like for Sadie. <laughs>